back in Portugal and back in court. But legal action they took five years ago was today stalled for the fourth time. Today is a blatant and cynical attempt to wear us down and it's Madeline who's suffering. Um, we're not going to give up, we're going to keep going. John Carlo Amaral initially led the inquiry into Madeline's disappearance. The McCanns turned to him in the early days, but he turned on them, publishing a book claiming Kate and Jerry faked their daughter's abduction. We, we took on this case because of the pain and distress that Mr Amaral has brought to us and our children. And every time he postpones the case like this, it brings us more pain and distress. Every time we come here, we have to make arrangements for our children to be looked after. We have to book flights. We have to book hotels. We have to take time off work to come here. Now, Mr. Amwell handed that letter in apparently around 9 o'clock this morning. That letter could have been handed in before we left the country. And this has happened now about four times. The investigation recently brought British police back to the Algarve, searching sites near the resort where Madeline was last seen alive. Areas that have never been looked at in such detail before now. What we know for certain is that there's no evidence that Madeline is dead. And until we she find her... She deserves that right to be found. We believe that Mr Amaral is trying to stop her, that human right of being looked for and found. It's happened to other children, it can happen to Madeline. Jerry McCann will return to Portugal when the trial resumes next month, but this visit left them no step closer to justice. Sally Lockwood, 5 News.